Welcome back, guys, to Tunic, where last episode we defeated the guard captain and obtained our first potion to escape the East Forest through a guard tower, locating and ringing the East Bell with a manual describing our next steps and setting us on a journey towards the West Bell. After a bit of sidetracked exploration into the old burying ground, barely escaping intact, we reached the old house and now search for a key to open it. Love the thought process. Yeah, well, you know, I'm just trying to be measured, careful. Uh worry about the things I see before me, what I should go for first, what I should not. Definitely looks like there's a new item for me to get around here, but uh What the what the Ow. Okay, so that's the thing it said I should have a shield for. I do not currently have a shield. Can I have your shield? Oh my goodness, uh, you're dead, man. Wow, you're really good at this, just like me. He dodged everything too. So any of those holes isn't somewhere I've got to put a thing into. It is unfortunately more likely to be something that I need to avoid. There's a page here. These guys are guarding. Uh, I mean, we got a red one here, which I can... But the green guy has kind of a more rat kind of disposition to him. A different look overall than our moblins here, you could say. I should go up this way first, but there's... Again. Oh, good. There's two different guys. And I got suckered in nastily. What on the other side of here? Remember, I do have a potion. So I've opened up the way from further up. <laughs> I honestly feel like I should just save again at this point. Rather than use the potion. Considering I just opened up that and I know exactly how to get back there. Now my bomb! My ice bomb! Well, now I know it's an ice bomb at least. <laughs> I guess look on the bright side. I accidentally used a thing. But I found out what the thing is. <laughs> okay, these guys can be abused a little bit by the height. Or at least their AI doesn't mean they shoot. I take it this guy down there is going to throw at me. Because that looks more like a spear than a sword. Come on! Help! Okay, not going that way. So it should come its sword hand direction. Okay, I've got another effigy. I'm assuming there's some kind of uh, thing to do with them, considering what the manual said. So it was to the right of the effigy, so I'm wondering if it's that, because I was wondering if I got eight money from an effigy before or not. So the next one be 60, next one be 32. I don't know. Meanwhile, I've got to... Oh, this... Uh, well, I... I see... You don't have a shield anymore, bud. You don't have a life anymore, bud. <laughs> Sorry. Can I have this? No. 
I dealt with a big boy. All right, so that's the old house key, is it? Now, do I want to go on a beach again? Because last time I went on a beach, I ended up in a horrible location. Meanwhile, I'm now on a fantabulous adventure over here. Nice. Okay, two more pages. Let's take it. <laughs> Custodians. Where the hell's this on the map? Caretakers of the vault who have learned some magic. Candles can be put out. Okay. Spyrite and Safarak. The spiders I've seen. Don't be fooled. The mark on their backs is a trick. I didn't see them for long enough because I panicked. So the golden platforms can be used in conjunction with the hero statue. I'd have to assume they're a warp, but page 24 is going to tell me more. Is there anything I need to pay attention to on this map that I'm not actually at yet? The ruined atoll. We see... Not much stuff. I say the most interesting bit on this page is that. The sun with a pattern on it. Well, of course, there's a floating thing, but why would a cloud be that patterned if there's nothing to do with that? Hello, there's a chest. Got another coin. It's just clouds. <laughs> sure, just clouds. I'm allowed to conspiracy theory, aren't I? Is that part of that gold thing we saw back, by the way? Like the bar those guys were standing next to? Cloud paranoia. Oh my me, I'm off on adventures, me. I don't know if I want to go on this adventure I'm currently on, though. I feel like this is a bit dumb. Oh, nice chest. Shame if there was an invisible map. Shame if we were going to make you navigate your way in and out. <laughs> You're gonna make me go away from it now, aren't you? I know what you. Uh... No, I think I'm gonna get there. So that was worth a lot of money. Great if I knew what on earth I was spending said money on. The use of said money. Let's continue enjoying our beautiful little game. We're doing pretty well at finding secret pathway things without doing this even. Just using my kind of like overall game sense, you could say. A bit worried about this. It's just some money there. So. This pattern is a bit interesting. This flower here? Nothing? Okay. It's just weird because the camera zooms in on it in such a deliberate way. Okay, where the... Where did you come from? And where was I originally that I didn't know you were there? I got another one of these. <laughs> Guess I didn't go that way because of the uh, the impending danger, dude. So I'm going this way. And where am I going? Oh no, I got a key, didn't I? <laughs> so until I've got a shield, I don't think I'm supposed to be dealing with these other routes yet, where the guns are. Obviously, I can kill them. 
but that doesn't mean it is efficient or good to do so. So we'll avoid them. We do have another coin. now says two. I don't know if I've got to put them into all the wells or just put coins into wells. That's truly the question here, isn't it? Uh, where is the... Oh, it's here. So this must be the old house then. I'm thankful this red guy will let me drink. Should I maybe save? No, I'm going to get myself... Shh. One coin. Luckily, we still see a way upwards, so it's all good. It's hidden beyond the old house, eh? Oh. Oh. Uh, definitely going to be able to find a way back again in a second, right? 100%, yeah. Definitely not getting locked into a dungeon. No, 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 no. Not at all. What? I didn't? <laughs> okay, I'm definitely just walking this way because of exploration spirits and all that. I just knocked off the skeleton. I've got a shield now. I can hide behind it. Can't open that. Now where am I going? <laughs> Another one of these. This path behind this waterfall. That was always there. What? Wait, could no, I couldn't have gone back the other way. That was always there. That was always there too. Sure, I, that, I mean that was totally always there. I knew it the whole time. I just didn't want to skip content. That's it. Yeah, yeah. Hidden pathways are blowing my mind at the moment. I've got a tooth! It's gone down the bottom. Bottom right. Die! <laughs> I knew one of you would be bad. I've got a shield, you know. Get out. Bad enough of... Dispose of them. It's fine. They might revive, right? Let's deal with them before that happens. <laughs> Yes. This is the way. Correct? I don't know. Let's go in there. I'm sure we'll be fine. I tell you that guy on the left that's like shivering about a bit is definitely in the live, right? I feel like I need a lantern. Okay. The <laughs> there was a place where it said that though. Uh, old house. So was that a path? Old house flooded well is next. This would be dark tomb then? Yeah, that's the dark tomb. Where's the flooded well? 
The well, page 29. Yeah, we've seen that. So that is above the old house. Now, how am I supposed to reach it? It was in between all the water area. Okay, well, I know that's not next now. Music change reminds me of some games we played, that's for certain. Well, there's two guys next to this chest here. There's no way I'm not rubbing it up. Let's see how much this shield actually blocks. So there we can see. So we can see it actively uses stamina. I've got a chili pepper, two of them. Danger. Would have guessed. I can rebound off of this one. Oh, combo. Got me good, he did. I'm happy with that. Much easier when I take him out in one go like that. How do I get that, Bob? No, no, I can. I can block you. Oops. Okay, uh, maybe my eyes are... No, come back! What did I do then? Wait, I did something then. Oh! I have a parry! I guess that's the special technique then. Okay, it turns out I cannot parry back into the face just as easy as I thought I could. <laughs> My strategy did not go as planned. It looks like that's the way to the old well, though. But I'm like seconds from death. And my exploration will be expunged. So I'm gonna... Wah! Run all the way back to this. It's a bit of a long... Uh, Attack parry, to be honest. <laughs> Maybe I should have explored more on the beach now that we can kind of get close to things, but... I do wonder if there would be more I could have found. Sudden realization I never went in here. That's very shiny. Where am I now? Well, it doesn't tell me to go in a windmill. Oh, no, 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 yeah, I'm totally out. Bye. Wait, well, you just... What? Hello? Hi? You want to offer me... For how much? 300, yeah, totally cool. I'll take both if you like. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> Don't tell me that was designed like some kind of skull thing. <laughs> to literally get that reaction and go like, this is bad. <laughs> but it's actually a shop. Oh, okay. It's too easy. You get the right reactions from me, game. So I gotta find a way to like lower these wooden platforms if there is a way. We could try down the lower path again first. Anyway, now we have uh, two bowls to restore HP. Oh, that was not the time to parry me.
I'm being chased by everyone. Ow! Okay, I managed to take them out. But I lost a bit of health for the process, you know? We may as well leave these two behind. They're not part of our experiment. Where was it I was going to? I came up here and there wasn't a whole lot of nothing. Oh, there's a treasure chest behind it. Oh, yeah. Ah! <laughs> I actually got a shot once then. Yeah, I might die if I do this to these guys that much. Okay. Something happened there. I feel like I got something, but I have no clue what. Oh, I got onto this island with this dude. That seems... Dumb. You designed it like this. <laughs> they've put... So I'm... Okay, cool, I beat this. But what they've done is they stuck the blooming guy on a single log, which is curved. You can't even chuck the bomb. They've made sure I couldn't bomb the guy. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna die if I stay, actually. Yeah, I have not done well on this foray. Why are you calling that guy Alvin? Because <laughs> we're the chipmunks. I don't know. I know that I probably do need to go that way then. Let's, let's just try and force it this way with two health instead of one health. Knowing that we're going to go forward and attack. Now, we can always buy more bombs, but what? We need the money for other things. Let's go, though. Hello? I didn't find this the first time. Oh. Okay. I guess I'm supposed to put something here? I wouldn't know what. <laughs> so we threw it on the ground. I do get more money. That's what the manual means. So the next one will give me 32. Kind of cool that, like, I got what the manual meant with the pending stuff. Look, stop trading! Free hits! <laughs> I guess the strategy is that I've got to get behind you. Oh, 
I'm gonna die coming up here. I know it. And this thing has a maximum range. Do I want you to hit this? Okay, I can just do it of my own free will. I am like totally dying right now, but that works. We made it through. I'm not really supposed to be fighting the things. If you seek to increase your power. One, two, three. Is this permanent? L1 at the shrine. Opens a different menu. Oh, okay. So we can get that to get a potion. So there's costs for money too. So I can increase my tech. I can increase my HP and I can increase my potion at this point in time. If I go there and pay money plus thingy for the first one, there's up to three maximum. Okay. <laughs> this is cool. It's not telling me like straight out because all the text is different for the most part. And let, except if you seek to increase your power. But it's fully legible and really understandable. There is definitely something that does some uh, random two things that do two random stats as well. So that's going to be something to look into. We've also got page 19. Death. Oh no. If you run out of health, I take it you just get brought back to life. Uh, I have no clue what's going on there. But it involves one of those panels that we've seen involving the wells. Spirit. Wait. If you die, do you walk around as a spirit and uh, you can interact with certain things as a spirit? That looks like you return to your body. I don't know what's going on. Could you sp echo of self? <laughs> Try to be this strong. <laughs> Attack free, defense free. You can do it. Garden Knight. So it's telling me to buff before I get to these positions? It's telling me before I fight the boss probably in the West Garden that I need to get lots of collectibles. Cool. So I'm at level one, so I basically want to upgrade things twice. So I'll offer a flower and 200 to increase my maximum HP. Cool. And you can see it's actually gotten bigger on the side too. So I can increase my attack. Which is obviously going to help a lot. Loud. So this one I can probably do two of. Okay, so that gave me an extra potion. So now I have... No, wait. It didn't give me an extra potion. It probably meant my potion refills more. Correct? Like the potion overall level. Try to have free attack and free defense, ignores it, and immediately does HP first. Respect. Hey, look, I get more money. I haven't got the items yet. I need to go exploring, right? Might as well do what I've got right now. May as well upgrade what I've got right now. Works for me. I've only got 152 in cash left, mind you. 
Right, so we have an increase in attack. The A A attack. Not enough to one shot those guys any like at all. <laughs> this sign never did never deserved that treatment. The wind chimes are going. I'm confused. I remember the wind chimes going before. They do make a shop kind of wind chime noise, which is pretty cool. Okay, so I need to go over here. So this is our next area. I think we're allowed to go in. I think this is where we're supposed to be going next. So uh, let's go. Beneath the well. <laughs> Now, just to remember, or have a memory, we do actually have a map for here. So under the well, we have a Slorm, auto bolts as well, circle around and use the shield. But sometimes it doesn't allow you to do that. So this is the map. We just have to work out how the map works compared to where I'm at. So assuming that in is at the bottom. Should know where the death room is. <laughs> Okay, there's a shlorm. <laughs> I wasn't staying around when that model didn't go floop on the ground. Okay, I'm definitely getting some alternate form of currency or something now. I don't know what those are. I have no clue, but they made me curious. Hi, shlorm. I'm out of there. I take it I can go wading. I can free shot you now, buddy. Looks like I can upgrade my potion some more. Meanwhile, in waterfall that must have a treasure behind it, I got another berry. So there's another source of HP outside of my potions. The best thing is, the first, like, I see a waterfall, I walk into it, I get a thing. What do I often say in most games whenever I see a waterfall? There better be a secret passage behind it. Tunic has been very nice for me on that. It agrees. <laughs> Obviously, I can't increase that anymore. A thousand is next. <laughs> Yeah, a little bit of thumping. First priority, find out what the death room is. I thought the first priority should be find out where everything else is. 